Alright guys, what's up? Welcome to, back to another video. Today we're going to be showing you guys how to get iPogo or iSpoofer on to any iPhone from 6S to the 10. So, I have an iPhone 7 here guys. We are going to be putting the, I, uh, the iPogo Pokemon Go or iSpoofer on it, which is already on it, as you guys can see. So, we're going to show you guys how to get that back onto your phone. So, what you're going to do is you're going to go to your browser. You want to put look up Alt Store into the link. I'll have the link in the description for you guys to go and download it. You want to download it from Windows. If you have a Mac, download from Mac. But it only it requires 10.14.4 plus. So that version requires that. It is not it will not work with any other else except for that newest version. Now, Windows 10, it'll work on any Windows 10, but it will not work with Windows 7, however. But, so what you want to do is you want to download it to Windows. I've already got it downloaded. And you want to have to have iTunes downloaded, which I already have iTunes downloaded, so I've got that downloaded, and I got uh, the alt store downloaded. What you're going to do is you want to, if you have Windows 10, expand your deal into the, uh, like this. And you'll see alt server like a little file right there. You want to click on it, and you want to. You'll see a little a little icon right down here by your battery bar or wherever it's by, and you want to click on it. Left click, and it'll pop up, and it'll show you. And if you're trying to do it without iTunes, it will not work. However, you have to have synced through Wi-Fi. But if you do not have it on, you have to have it plugged up. So what I'm going to do is, we are going to be opening up iTunes from my computer. And we're going to show you how this is working through to my phone. So, as soon as this loads up, we will come, we will come back. Well, that's all I got. Okay, so now my phone is not connected. But if uh, you'll have to have it plugged up to do anything, really. That is required. So I'm going to plug my mouse. I'm going to grab my cord from the socket, and we're going to plug it in. I'm going to plug it into the slot. All right, we're going to plug it from right here. And when you get to your phone, if it's not been plugged up to any computer at all, you want to click on Allow the Sources on it to do anything for it to even, the, the device to even show up. So now you want to click on this, and you want to go down back to that icon and you want to click on it and you should be able to download it now there you go there's I, uh, my iPhone 7 once you click on it it'll tell you that it's installing once it's complete you go to your phone and you look at it now on the other hand I'm gonna bring up the phone thing so you guys can see what I'm doing what I'm gonna be doing for my phone to download this app so I'm going to do that now, and I'll come right back to you guys. Alright guys, I am back. I got it up. So, I'm going to go ahead and connect to it, and get it going. Before I end up continuing to talk about it, I'm going to tell you guys that I forgot to mention that you got to, uh, once you download the alt store file, you want to go to the download into your documents, and click download. And you want to go into looking for that file and unzip it or ex uh, extract it and once you extract it you can install that app and once it's installing it'll be on your computer I forgot to mention that so I'm missing that now so let's give you guys a heads up but I will show you guys at the end of the video what I'm talking about <laughs> okay but anyway so you want to go into your phone I've already got all store onto my phone you want to go to your settings once it's done and you want to go down to general all the way down to device management and you'll see the email I'm using and then you want to go into you want to see your email that's connected to it that Apple can't touch once you have this downloaded on your phone Apple cannot wipe this off your phone they cannot take it from you they cannot delete it they can't not revoke it they can't do nothing that it, this is going to prevent Apple from revoking any of these apps. So, well, and if it's signed to you, 
you will you'll have your access to everything. After that, you're good. You won't have to worry about no Apple uh, revoking any of the apps and stuff like that. After that, you want to verify this app with your email and shit. And after that, you're done. You go back all the way to your alt store. And you want to keep this open. So, all my shit, guys. I'm going to go to alt store. You want to keep this open and go to my apps. And you're going to want to... <clears throat> you're gonna want to uh, go to a IPA file. If you use iPogo, you're gonna want to go to iPogo Pokemon Go for iOS 3, 13. Kawaba download. That's what I said. Kawaba download. And you want to scroll all the way down to you see the download iPogo the IPA right there. And once you do that, you go down and you will see the little blue icon ipogo.ipa 106 megabytes click on it and once you do that it'll be in the corner right by the refresher and if you use ice spoofer however hold on let me go to ice spoofer ice spoofer you're going to want to go to this this website and you're going to go in it where it says click here you're going to go to it says click here to download the ice spoofer for pogo ipa and once you do that it'll be in the corner boom yada 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 and after that, you want to go to this, and you see this plus corner up here, guys. You want to click on it, and you click on any of these apps, and it'll start to download onto your phone. Once that's done, you have completed this whole process and all of my steps. And after that, you are good. But I want to mention, once you, this, uh, these seven days on both of these apps expire, you're wanting to click on it to update it to seven, uh, to the seven days again. So that way it won't have to worry about dropping it in case. That I don't know. But when you get in there, you, get, you sign into your uh, your iCloud account before you do any of this. You want to sign into your email. Go to your settings and sign into it. And after that, boom, you are done. So after that, you put all my steps and you're done. But anyway, guys, or actually another way you can do it. Is by clicking on the expires in seven days, and it'll pop up the email and the password for you to put in. So that way you can put it in there easier. But anyway, guys, that is gonna be the video for today. Thank you guys for watching. There's a like, subscribe, comment below when we do next. I will see you guys later. And if I have another video by any chance for hacking and getting Ice Spoofer back or iPogo back, I will let you guys know. This is my new way of knowing it. I finally figured this out. It took me at least about a week or two just to get this figured out. But anyways, I will see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Give a like, subscribe, and comment down below me to do next. I will see you guys later. And peace out. Alright guys, before I leave this, leave this, uh, I forgot to show you guys at the end of the video. This is how you're going to be able to do it when you, get that, uh, when you start the download and click to the file. And once you click on the file, you're going to go to your folder and go to downloads. Let me go to the screen like this. It will be easier. You're going to go to downloads, and you guys are going to see it right down here. I'll see, where's it at? Alt, alt installer. You're going to see it zipped right here. You're going to see it right there, and you're going to want to go here and click right click. Okay, now you're going to want to uh, click on it and extract it, but the only way for you to extract it is click on it from here. And you want to go down to, it says extract all. Once you click extract all, it'll open up all to this. Like this. They're both the same installation. And the installer, too. They're both the in, the same installers. So either which one you click on, it'll be the same thing. But anyway, guys, that's the video for today. Thank you guys for watching. The like, subscribe, comment below. I am sorry if I forgot to put that in the video. But uh, anyway... I just want to give you guys that little heads up on that. But anyways, guys, I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below in the next. Comment blah, 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 blah. Like, subscribe, and comment down below what you guys will. Blah, 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 I can't talk. Okay. Like, subscribe, and comment down below what you guys want me to do next. And I will see you guys later. And peace out. Bye.